Yeah. Other news tonight, sweeping changes could be coming to short-term rental properties in Wichita. This includes places like Airbnbs. Turns out many of the more than 400 properties are out of compliance with code, and now the city is looking to put some regulations in place. KSN's Hannah Adamson has more on this story. It's new at 10 tonight. Hannah. Jeff, Emily, these recommendations stem from an incident in April 2021 where a shooting at an Airbnb left one person dead. This as the number of Airbnbs in Wichita has more than doubled since 2018, and those who are in the business say that growth shows no signs of stopping anytime soon. For the past year, Travis Dorian has been hosting guests at one of his properties through Airbnb and VRBO. He plans on listing two more short-term rentals in the near future. The Wichita area is just starting to get traction in the Airbnb space. Dorian says while he and dozens of others in Wichita's tight-knit short-term rental community are all for additional health regulations and proper permits, he's currently questioning other proposed recommendations the brought forth by the city. We're not opposed to it. I think that we just need to get on board and on the same page of what that looks like, how that affects us as hosts. District 4 City Councilman Jeff Blubaugh says his biggest concern revolves around a recommendation to limit the number of short term rentals in a 600 foot radius moving forward. There can only be one in that 600 feet. 600 feet may not look like a lot. I counted out nine blocks. I don't think it's necessarily fair to, to knock the other people out there. However, Mayor Whipple the says these recommendations have a long way to go before being set in stone, adding the city could take a more targeted approach when it comes to so-called problem areas. We have heard from some neighborhood associations uh, that it really have had bad experiences with Airbnbs within those uh, communities uh, while also acknowledging that we've had parts in our community where Airbnbs have been very successful. So we're trying to walk that line. Blue Bus says he's asking for data in terms of how many complaints against short term rentals the city has received. City officials emphasize if the 600 foot radius limit is put into effect, all pre existing short term rentals will be grandfathered into that policy. Here for you, Hannah Adamson, KSN News 3.